I'm going on my knees and praying to a God I do not know. Oh, what would it profit me if I don't enjoy this very life, the parties, the chillings, and the beaches? Oh, that sweet scented herb in the ghetto that sets me high in the disco. No greater feeling than this. So these were his words to me when I reached out to him. But thanks be to God, I never left him the same. So these were my words to you. Have you ever wondered how this entire earth came into being? Have you actually sat yourself down to deeply think of how and who created the creatures including human beings? You see, you are not staring at me. Because all you enjoy is fiction. Stories and cartoons of Aladdin, your addiction to alcohol, betting and weed, Aswadin, but listen, today pay heed to my teaching. You see, you're still staring at me, right? You see, no matter how high you are, you can never be higher than the Messiah. So quench this fire. Kill the fleshly desires. Grab the word of God because that's all you require. The word is truth. My life is a proof. Again, I say the word is truth. My life is a proof. I ain't a liar. I'm a lion. I'm so strong and courageous because I hail from Zion. So the word of God is truth and my life is a proof. Then I ministered to him in psalms, hymns and spiritual songs. Men and brethren, our chat was not prolonged. This guy started blasting in tongues. It was at this point I knew this soul was one and that is how he was firmly grounded in the church. But it didn't end there. I exposed him to the excellent mode of making him excel by grabbing the undiluted word of God, which is the uninterruptible PowerPoint, which gives him unlimited access to God's account. And that is the exceptional part of this very thing. That is where the cell structure comes in to reform and transform you to do excellent works while you are here on earth, daily adding to the church. So finally, brethren, you know, as it's mostly said, that in this world, in this world, there are two things involved, and I'll do it with you. It's either you are in or you are what? It's either you are married or you are. It's either you are saved or, or you are lost. So let's halt it there. Once you are saved, now there are no two things involved. There are three. And in these three categories, you fall into one. One, the saved. Two, saved but not converted. And three, converted and spiritual. This is where the cell structure once again comes in. To firmly ground you. To transform and reform you. To elevate you so that it can be, you can be rightly positioned to wait for what? The coming of the Lord and you will be in heaven while doing significant exploits right here on earth. Winning souls and in turn training them to become so very inspiring soul winners too. And it's as a result of the cell structure or the cell system. You know what? Now we're back to this very level. A church is family of God. But the cell is a family meeting of God. And in this meeting, you know what we do? We pick one another. When we pick with comfort, we elevate, we exalt. We love one another. We prefer one another. And in this very cell structure, we pray for one another to see the progress of one another. Again, in this very cell, which is God's family meeting, we are the saviors. So once you become born again, everyone is a soul winner because that is the grace that the Lord has lavished upon you. The evidence of this very grace is you going out to win souls and the cell structure teaches you that. 
So why escape yourself and not subscribe into this very cell structure? So I want to admonish all of you here that from now on, if you have a cell and you've not been active, be active. If you have none, make sure you subscribe to a new one now, today. Do not forsake the assembly of the brethren, the Bible tells us. As many make it a habit. Let's encourage one another. Just as we see the day of the Lord approaching. So finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are just, if there be any virtue and if there be any praise, think on these very things. Beyond thinking, act them. Be them. Thank you.